Well, somebody asked me if I could show a few of the rifles that I had camouflaged without using Duracoat, so here they are. Uh, way back in the back there, you can see it's a 50 caliber side lock muzzle loader. That's mostly camo. <clears throat> Below that is a SKS with a folding stock on it. That's in uh, brown, uh, green, a little bit of black, a little bit of red in there. And the bottom one is a uh, 177 caliber air rifle. Uh, it's a brake barrel type. And that's all in camo. And down below there are a few knives I've done. Uh, if it's paintable, I can paint it. Okay, there's uh, my some of the camo things I did, and there's a few of my uh, wood carvings I'm working on. Uh, Daffy, Garfield, and uh, Roadrunner. And uh, the kind of paint I used was Krylon and Rust-Oleum, and maybe some miscellaneous black paint laying around, but uh, you can buy pretty good camouflage paint at Walmart and unless you're going to be out in the woods or in the desert for you know an extended period and like that's like over a week uh, Duracoat is fine if you can afford it but you can clean your rifles and Duracoat is not really necessary as far as I'm concerned anyway those are my rifles and a few things that I've camouflaged with just regular paint non Duracoat knuckle bump <laughs>